everyone so I look really weird right now because I have you know my brows my face done but no eye makeup no lip makeup no blush no highlighter or anything I thought today I would do something a little bit different because lip monthly got in touch with me to do a little like I don't know show and tell of their little service the funniest thing is I actually signed up for the service myself because I saw Sally talk about it. I think it was Sally so I signed up for it because you guys know how much I love lip products but I did get this one early to show you guys I haven't even looked inside yet self-control so lip monthly is a new subscription service which basically you sign up for um, they do ship worldwide I believe I mean they ship to New Zealand for sure the actual service is $10 I believe it's free shipping within the states so you get at least three to four full-size products to try out plus a couple of samples one or two samples in there as well and they've told me that everything in here is a you know permanent product apparently one time they put in a limited edition product and it was really awesome and everyone wanted to buy it but they couldn't so from now on they only put in permanent products that you can like buy later on if you end up loving it and they do include well-known brands as well as brands you may never have heard of which is why I want it because I'm constantly buying lip products if you've seen my makeup collection you know what I'm talking about. I've basically tried most of the mainstream branded lip products out these days so I'm always looking for new products to try. So trying out smaller businesses and like niche brands and stuff like that is just, I don't know, it's more beneficial for me. Okay so let's get into it. It comes in this little makeup bag which is awesome. It's good that you can like reuse the actual packaging it comes in. Okay so I'm looking in here. So first off I see a Starlux Lip Sugar which looks like a little sample. Smells really good, like brown sugar. Can I eat it? I'm gonna use some, why not? Usually with these kind of lip scrubs, especially if it's a sugar one, you just lick your lips <laughs> and apply it. Okay, it does taste good, guys. <laughs> there we go, flake free lips. <laughs> we have a little, what is this? A lip balm by the looks of it. No, yeah, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. It comes with a little card as well for a discount code. 20% off all lipsticks, lip glosses, and lip balms on the website, which is awesome. So this is a vanilla lip balm. Perfect, because I need some lip balm. Oh my gosh, it smells like creme brulee. By the way, the reason I have no eye makeup on or anything is because I thought I might as well use what I get in the little bag and do some kind of like eye look that'll suit all of the lip colors and I think I'm gonna center it around Halloween and something sexy for Halloween for people that don't want to necessarily dress up as anything maybe you just want to wear like some kind of costume and then just chuck on makeup okay next up I can see four more things in here first up is this cherry moya lip crayon this is in the shade fig the packaging is really really nice and it's just a purple color. It's very balmy. It's like a lip balm except it's really, really opaque. We'll try that on soon. Next is J Cat Beauty. I've actually wanted to try this brand. Um, it's the Fantabulous Lipstick in the shade Honey Crisp. It's like a darker kind of peachy nude. Next is a LA Girl Eyeliner, but I guess you can use it on your lips as well. This is in the shade Blue Metallic. That's the color there, really pretty. I've never tried LA Girl Eyeliners before or eyeliner on my lips so that's what that looks like. The next thing we have here is Look Divine with Benefits from Wine. Pinot Noir and it's like a little, it almost looks like a little lip balm product. I've never seen anything like this before. Okay this is like a tinted lip balm. It smells pretty good. Alright so we got a lip balm, a lip scrub and a tinted lip balm. And then we got the makeup bag, and then we get the LA Girl, we got this, which is my favorite, I think. And then this lipstick here as well for $10, so I don't think that's bad at all. Actually, it's really good as well if you're trying to branch out to different colors and things. Because you're going to spend the $10, and then perhaps you'll get scent colors that you wouldn't normally wear, so it'll help you branch out a little bit. So down below, I will put a link to the website, and then I have a promo code, which is Halloween, and that will give you 50% off your first box. So that is a pretty decent discount. Okay, so I'm going to do an eye tutorial and then use these three lip colors and we'll see how they look on my lips. For Halloween, I know loads of people just like, you know, having the sexy Halloween makeup. So I'm just going to do a generic sexy smoky eye that you can use on Halloween. Pair it up with whatever lip color you would like and then all you have to worry about is your costume. So let's get started. And obviously you could wear this makeup look any day to dates or to clubbing or whatever. So I'm just going to jump in. Yay. First off, I'm just going to use some primer on my eyelids. 
just so that the colors pop. So for Halloween, I'm guessing you wanna do dark smoky eyes. So first off, I'm taking a taupe light brown color and you can just use whatever you have and then just pop that in the crease. And this is gonna be a little transa transition, transition shade. Now that is done, I'm gonna take a champagne color and I'm gonna put that on the inner kind of half of my eye. I'm also running that underneath my lashes as well. And then I'm taking a darker colour and putting that in the outer V, just like a dark brown or something like that. So outer V and also bringing it about halfway across or a third across. And then I'm also going to start kind of winging it out just a little bit. I'm going to take that first colour I put in my crease and just touch that up a little bit and then blend out the edges really, really well. Now I'm going to take my highlighter and I'm actually going to use that on my brow bone as well as on my cheekbone. And that'll just make it look so much more dramatic. I'm using a fan brush just to apply the highlighter. Now I'm going to do a little bit of a winged eyeliner. You could do none, you could do a huge wing, you could do a slim wing. It's really up to you. And then with my wing, since I am going to do a wing, I'm going to kind of copy that shape that I've put here with that eyeshadow. Now I am going to touch up that inner corner in a second because I'm going to do kind of like a cat eye just to make it super sexy. So first I'm taking a black eyeliner and rubbing that in my waterline. And then I'm taking my eyeliner and just pointing out that inner corner just a little bit. You literally want to just do the tiniest little one because if you do too much it looks intense like just the smallest amount looks really 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 pretty now I'm using a black and I'm just going to smudge the outer corner a little bit down just to really emphasize the cat eye shape now you can finish off the look with a bit of mascara and false eyelashes if you want so I'm gonna apply my mascara first So that's the eye look, super cat eye. I mean, perfect if you want to go as a cat. You could draw on a cute little nose and some whiskers or something. Anyway, I'm going to add a little bit of blush. I'm just going to use a kind of peachy pink blush that will go with every lip colour since I am trying on, you know, quite different lip colours. Okay, so first I'm going to try the nude. I'm really excited about trying this because I have heard a lot of good things about J-Cat Beauty. This is in the shade Honey Crisp. I know a lot of you would prefer this look here, which is just really wearable, nude lips, smoky eye, really glamorous and gorgeous. Here in New Zealand, we're not really huge on Halloween, but a lot of people my age do dress up and go clubbing and like Halloween gear, so that would be perfect. Like, this look would be perfect. Alright, next up, we're going to do the uh, Cherry Moya, Cherry Moya, I don't know how to pronounce it, fig um, coloured lip balm kind of product. I am a huge fan of this colour. This is so pretty. Something I would wear on an any day basis. I love it. It's such a cool idea. Okay, so that is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you are interested, don't forget to check out the down bar for the discount code, 50% off. So if you are experimental with your lip colours, or if you are just a lip junkie like me, definitely check it out. If you recreate this eye look, make sure you tag me on Instagram or on Twitter, hashtag me, ShanXO. I would love to come and have a look at your recreations. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll talk to you very, very soon. Bye! Dress hair is really, really cute. Again, another kind of like risque kind of outfit. It's got a lot of cutouts in it. 
as you can see just there. And then at the top it's got a really cool kind of design, like really kind of, what's the word, geometric cutouts very square <laughs> and then it's got a big cutout at the back as well and then it's just bodycon I feel like every single thing I got was bodycon nearly but I'm just loving the trend at the moment well when did bodycon ever go out of trend I don't know not in New Zealand anyway next is another maxi dress but this one is white 